wills. As you accumulate assets, you must think of who will get them if you die suddenly. A will is a legal document setting out your wishes for how your money and assets are divided up after your death. It can also cover other matters, such as who takes care of your children. If you don't have a will, the government distributes your assets to your family, which could potentially lead to arguments. There are do-it-yourself will kits available at news agents, but it really is an area where you should seek professional advice. There are a number of legal requirements for a valid will. These include, the will must be in writing. The will must be signed by the testator at the end of the will. The testator, or the person making the will's signature, must be witnessed by two independent adults. It's important to note that a beneficiary or a spouse, being a husband or wife, cannot witness a will. The beneficiaries must sign the will in the presence of the testator, which is the person making the will, and also each other. Some of the issues you need to consider include who would you like to administer your estate? Who would you like to benefit from your estate? Are there any specific bequests you would like to make? Who will look after your children if you die? And how would you like your body disposed of? Some of the more common mistakes in this area include not having a will, losing your will, failing to express your intentions clearly, giving assets that are not owned by you, or not having a will witnessed. This is an area where it is worth seeking advice from a suitably qualified lawyer or a trustee company. The consequences can be quite devastating if you get it wrong.